Okay, you're looking at the launch page, the launch section for the Pyro Media Center. As you can see, we kept it nice and simple. Your online videos, recommended, music, settings, local, and my apps. Uh, you'll, you'll notice that we don't have the Kodi icon displayed anywhere. And that's because we use our own version and that's why it's the Pyro Media Center. It's, it's a, a personalized custom version of Kodi that was, that was done for us. And it functions just the same. We just, you know, kind of tweaked it to make it work with our player a bit better. So when we launch it, it'll start with the start screen, which will bring in everything from tracks that we had initially saved to our list and that's those first two sections then everything else starts to populate shortly thereafter that the latest movies the latest TV shows um, all the different genres of things and it stays updated and connected primarily because of the track service for the first two sections and then for the various add-ons that we use for the other sections like salts Exodus, Prime Wire, things like that. So the build is really simple. We kept it um, really, really user friendly. So when people are inside the box, they can get to the sections they want to get to really quickly. So again, up top are the favorite movies that we saved in tracks. Under that are the favorite TV shows that we saved. And then you'll get everything else that is pulled in through the other widget areas which are the latest movies, the most popular movies, Oscar winners, new TV shows, um, new episodes of shows and things like that. So with all the widgets happening that's why we have a faster faster processor and we have more RAM because we need to be able to pull all this information at one time. We've also kept everything nice and simple inside, so if you want to see movies, TV shows, you can go there. We still kept our TV on demand section, which when you go into that will bring up all of the networks. The local channels, as you've seen in some previous videos, is connected to the HD Home Run Extend, and that will allow you to connect that to your router, plug a HD antenna up to it, and pull in all of your local channels so your local news your sporting events and things like that you have the benefit of being able to watch that while inside of Cody without having to go from HDMI to TV the news and kids section is still the same sports Phoenix has a lot of different different things that that they've done and we just thought that it would be very beneficial to have that in there as well and everybody loves our favorite section because that's where we have the podcast, everything, so that you can learn different languages, math, cooking, workout videos, you name it. The weather section, of course, we've taken out the other, I don't really use it, it went back to Yahoo. So it gives it like a nice clean effect, nice fresh look. You can check your weather once you set that up. Um, it's really, again, simplistic. The adult section, we've taken that and we basically tore out all of the bad add-ons that weren't working and just really kept the ones that were the premier ones so that people can have I guess more or less an outlet to watch the type of shows that they want to watch so everything loads quickly it's really dynamic and quick uh, we kept the movie and TV genres down at the bottom and everything from the latest episodes which are episodes from every show not just the ones you saved in tracks and tracks those would be the ones that are there that are your primary shows that's just every TV show something that I also like about the tracks is that since we have it synced with salts when you go into salts it allows you to pull up your calendar now I personally like this because it's helped me really to watch TV um, more, more on demand and with the things that I like versus just being a couch potato. And when you go down to your calendar section, what I like about it is that it tells me what shows that I like 
that come on that day. So as you can see, today I have Kingdom, Mr. Robot, Tyrant, and Mr. Robot again. Four shows, which will take about mm, three hours to watch. But that's three hours that I can dedicate to the shows that I like to watch. And then I'm really done after that. I can study, I can read, I can relax, I can do anything else besides just being attached to a TV, trying to find something to entertain me when I know these are the only shows that I really, really want to see. So the Pyromedia Center and the Pyromedia Center build are excellent. They really complement each other, and it gives you a real dynamic environment for you to watch television on demand. Well, we hope that you really like it. If you have any feedback and would like more information, feel free to reach out to us and let us know. Thank you for watching this video.